Hey good people, welcome back to Beauty in the Frizz. My name is Kara. Whether you're new or returning, thank you so much for stopping by and clicking on the video. Today is day 23 of Frizzmas. So this video is part one of two. I thought it would be a great way to end Frizzmas trying a new brand. Well, this brand is new to me. Some of you may have heard of it, but it is Alien Cosmetics. So if you wanna see the two palettes that I bought and see some looks, keep on watching this video. Don't forget to let me know what you think. Definitely consider subscribing and joining the community. I love you guys so much and I'd love to have you back. All right, let's get started. So I am still waiting on most of what I ordered from Black Friday, but I did receive my two palettes from Alien Cosmetics. So we're just gonna talk about them today. And my focus is gonna be on their holiday palette, but I am gonna just show you both since this is like a part one of two. The first palette is the Holiday 2020 palette. This is the Alien and Gem Casket Holiday 2020 palette. Look at this artwork. I really, really like it. It's really, you know, dark. When I saw this palette, I knew I had to have it because it reminded me a little bit of Melt Muerte. Yes, I'm still talking about it. So let's just take a look. Now this palette was $40. And like I said, it's not exactly like Muerte, but it gives me those vibes. And as soon as I saw it, I was like, I am getting this palette. I, I don't care. I want it. So yes. I don't know if Jim Casket is the name of the palette or the artist but this is their holiday 2020 palette. It is unfortunately sold out. I don't know if they're bringing it back, which is very sad. Don't see a shelf life on here. So I'll have to look into that. Now the second palette that I ordered was Fairy Frolic and that's this here. Now this has a 12 month shelf life. So I'm gonna assume that the, the other one does too. Let's take a look at the inside. Now this one was $25. So this is the one I'm gonna be focusing on tomorrow. But look at this, oh my gosh, so pretty. Both of these palettes are very unique to what I own. We're gonna just focus on the Gem Casket palette because I did, I did have this eye look on in another video and a lot of people asked me what I had on my eyes and, and this was it. So this is not a first impressions. I love this palette. It is really, really, really good. So let's just uh, do some swatches. Oh, there are no shade names. So we're gonna just go row by row with the 12 shades and then we'll get into some looks. So, all right. So let's swatch the first row. Here are the swatches on my fingers. I'm gonna swatch the matte one more time. Like I said, I've used this shade before. So this is this shade is really unique right here. These are really gorgeous. All right, let's move on to the second row. So here is the second row. And here are the shades on the fingers. I'm gonna swatch these two one more time. All right, so here are the first two rows. And now we'll get into this last row. And here are the shades on the fingers. Oh, that, now that is just. All right, so here is the Alien Cosmetics Holiday Palette. What do y'all think about this? Like I said before, I feel like that color story is really, really unique. It's different than anything I have, and I'm not sure the story behind how the colors were chosen, but I definitely like it. I like it a lot. So let's go ahead and do two looks. Um, yeah, I just feel like we have to. We need to try to use as many shades as possible so we can see. And hopefully they will bring this back because they need to bring it back. Okay guys, I'm gonna let the music play while we get into these looks, and then I'll be back to wrap it all up.
Okay, you guys, so with looks like this that are so bold, I am going to need a lash. So I am going to just show you what we have so far. And I know you're probably like, whoa, this is a lot. Yes, it is a lot. Like this is a dramatic palette. This is gonna be for color lovers. I know that, okay, sorry. I know that we can create some lighter looks, but I mean, look at this palette. These colors are deep and they're bold, so. I just went for it with this. So I will be back. I'm gonna do mascara and lashes and then we'll see the big picture. Y'all, I'm back, okay. Can we, can we talk about this palette? Okay, let's get the close up. Cause see, at first it was looking a little crazy to me. But look, so once you put the lashes on, see lashes just give you a whole nother situation i needed the lashes to to hold up this look because without it i don't know i might look like a clown a little bit so i don't know what the lashes look like with my eyes closed but hopefully they are on good oh my god what do y'all think about this mm, mm, mm. i love it i love it i, I I think I like this eye better. This was similar to the first look I did, but I mean, I love both looks. They're really, really pretty. I have to practice more with red, but whatever. Okay, you guys. So again, this was part one of two. So I will be back tomorrow doing two looks with the Fairy Frolic palette. And again, I'm so sorry that both of these palettes are sold out. I hope Alien Cosmetics will restock because this is a great palette. The other thing, oh, that I wanted to tell you is that they have another very, very popular palette, which I think that pre-order might've sold out too. It's the Serendipity palette. So I ordered that and there's a blue and brown palette that I ordered as well. So that should be coming at some point. I have no idea when. So I will have more coming from Alien Cosmetics. And I hope you all are really excited about seeing these palettes and these looks. Um, again, honestly, I'm just waiting for my Black Friday stuff to come and whenever Cleona gets here, but I am kind of going into a shop my stash mode because I really want to get used out of what I bought and just be creative and play. I'm, 
I want to review, but I also want to play and I want to inspire. So I hope you all are down for that because I'm, I'm, that's what I'm ready to do. I want to learn some new makeup techniques, some different ways to apply eyeshadow and just just really work on that part of the makeup and you know just have fun without always having to buy something new so hopefully that sounds good to you all right you guys well i hope you all enjoyed this video thank you guys for hanging with me on day 23 of frismas and i hope to see you on day 24 make sure you are being gentle with yourself talk to yourself nice stay safe and i'll see y'all tomorrow bye <music>